Hey guys, welcome back to another Top 10 Frags video. I promise, no sound effects this time. Today we're highlighting frags from the ESEA LAN Finals for Season 10. At number 10, we see Flowsick from UMX completely soloing against three members of Black and White in middle. Plays like this one is why Counter-Strike is so lovable, truly highlighting individual skill and performance on LAN. Number 9 is a really fun shot to see hit as it shows three perfectly aligned headshots with a single spray. Common online, but again, big to see on land. Polly comes in here at number 8, we'll see him again in a little bit. Check out these deagle shots he's able to connect. You can see that he knows exactly when he hits the ground in order to get the most accurate shot possible. Steno, most commonly known for his in-game leadership ability and less for his individual performance, makes his way in here at number 7 to show off his stuff. On a full gun round for both teams, he forced buys a FAMAS and is able to shut down Check 6 Gaming completely. At number 6, we see Dizaman trying to scout out the storage area, and he's able to work through, clear the site, and plant the bomb. He makes it look easy, but remember that this is against the top team back-to-back. Remember when we were little kids watching Complexity doing their thing at major tournaments? Veterans from that classic team such as Fraud are still enjoyable to watch today, proving he's still consistent as a dangerous sniper. Number 4 here, XP3 opening up the round with a clean deeg to the face of Imp, connecting nicely and securing the defuse later in the round. The last frag was so important to hit, Steno could have easily hid. Only a professional player like XP3 will hit those shots almost every time. Perez making an appearance here for number 3. Let's switch over to the live shout casting for the match. Perez actually going to go down early. Um, to go down early, take down Michi and uh, BTK. That Glock is lethal from Perez. It really is. And uh, we're now down to a 2 on 3. Perez here with a 3k already. Yeah, we're now down to a 1 on 2. Hostile does not have the time to deal with this. Oh, he Perez does! Takes him down. Again, let's listen to the shoutcasting here for Peachy at number 2 as he works his off. At 2 on 4 right now, Polly and Imsta. Bob is going to go ahead and get planted. There goes Polly Peachy. Uh, we haven't seen a lot of uh, life since uh, earlier in this uh, first half. He had a lot of great, incredible off shots. Uh, to kick things off, he actually had a fourth round. And Donatello picked up that fifth one. Here we go, the number one highlight from the Season 10 LAN. Not a surprise to see top North American star Pauly running business with his rifle on DE Nuke. Such a solid play absolutely makes him look effortless, but is able to single-handedly stop a professional team from having any chance at winning the round. Thanks for watching, this was Connor Cakebuilder General Corps. Stay tuned for more videos at ESEANews.com.